And welcome back to David Story Field. We're live with Matthew Schwartz here for our The Daily News Khaled's Black Bears postgame show. 3-1 loss today to the Ridgefield Raptors, but Schwartz, it looked like going up there, the guys still had the same approach from the very beginning of the game to the end. And, you know, even when the bats aren't working today, you got to give yourselves a lot of credit for at least coming on up there and making those pitches work today. What was the atmosphere like in the dugout with that? Yeah, totally. We just tried to stick to our approach today, even though – we were hitting the ball hard, nothing was falling, but we were consistent and stayed with our approach, and it was looking good for us, but just couldn't get that timely hit yet again today. So Yeah, it looked like you almost had that. What was it like when you were on base seeing that towering shot by Bozette just miss the barn in center field? That was a tough one. Oh, I was just praying that it fell. The kid made a great play to go run that thing down, but, yeah, we really that would have been a really nice thing for us to have fall right there. So three quick-ish quick, quick -ish runs for Ridgefield today. The bullpen comes in, delivers three and two-thirds scoreless. How much does that help you as an offense, knowing that your pitchers have your back and are keeping it close and always giving you guys a chance to win the games? Oh, yeah, totally. Our bullpen definitely keeps in the game quite a bit, and we just know whoever's out there, they're going to throw up a zero for us. So we just need to kind of help them out a little bit more with the bats, but that'll come for sure. Now stepping away from the team a little more personally, I know we've been talking about this game to game. We're now on a seven-game hitting streak. The ball looking like a beach ball up there lately. Uh, sort of, kind of. I mean, <laughs> just trying to stick to my approach and uh, have good at-bats and hit the ball hard, trying to just help my team win at this point. So. And is it easier to hit when you're over here at LCC, your home field during the spring? Oh, definitely. It's nice to be comfortable in a comfortable environment for sure. All right, Matt. Thank you so much for the interview, and uh, good luck the rest of the way. We got two more games coming at you at 6.35 p.m., one on Saturday, one on Sunday. Get your tickets at CalitzBlackBears.com, or, of course, tune in on KEDO or KEDOAM.com. Or right now, if you're watching, on the Calitz Black Bears YouTube channel, we love having you over. Matt, once again, thank you so much for Pleasure coming on mine. in. We're thanking Matt. We're thanking Justin Ford behind the camera. We're thanking Jacob Ackerman back home. And, of course, we're thanking you, the viewers, so much for tuning on in today and the listeners as well on KEDO. My name is Zach Smolin. Have a great evening. Stay frosty.